The most common question that we get at this time of the year is when to apply pre-emergent herbicides for crabgrass control. Pre-emergent herbicides have to be applied prior to germination of crabgrass, and so they normally have to be applied about the first, no later than about the first week of May. And uh, that's when you're making a single application, which most people do on their home lawns. And uh, when you go to the store, you have a, a thousand products to choose from. Overall, all of the active ingredients that you have to choose from with the pre-emergent herbicides are pretty comparable. There's really none that really stick out as better or worse. What I'm more concerned about is the amount of nitrogen that you will find in the bag, because uh, all of these products are combined with the fertilizer, and they make makes for easier application. And uh, if you look around a lot, you will be able to find, occasionally you'll be able to find a product that comes without the fertilizer. The reason why we don't want fertilizer at this time of the year is that the grass will be growing quickly, naturally, on its own. And by adding more nitrogen, you get a lot more top growth and it's a lot harder to keep up with the mowing. And so if you look around hard enough, you can probably find a bag without any fertilizer. But in most cases, you'll find uh, pre-emergent herbicides with fertilizer. And so my recommendation is when you're buying product, look at the amount of fertilizer that is in the bag. And so you look at, you know, for this, for instance, this bag, if you look closely at the bag, it's 36%. And this is a 13 pound bag. And so that works out, if you do the math, that works out to be about five pounds of nitrogen in this bag. This treats a thousand, or 5,000 square feet so you're putting down a pound of nitrogen. To me, that's a little high, but it just depends what you'll find. Look around a little harder, another bag, and this bag is only 30% uh, nitrogen. And again, this is about a 13 pound bag, treats 5,000 square feet, so if you do the math, that works out to be about 8 tenths of a pound of nitrogen. Not a huge difference, but a step in the right direction. So when you're pro buying product, Try to find product with either no nitrogen or as little nitrogen as possible. Apply it if you're making a single application, apply it about the first week of May. If you're making multiple applications, which is the best way to control uh, crabgrass, you could apply it earlier than May and then that second application would be about the first week of June.